Hey kids, it's Hannah from Kids Club here. Now I wonder if you want to go get your drink and get a snack ready. I've got my water bottle here because it's time for this week's World Changers Tea Party. Now we love talking about at Kids Club how we believe you are going to be the world changers because we believe that you can change um, your families, your friends, um, your schools, your communities, all those um, people and places where you spend a lot of your time, we believe you can change the world and you can make those places a better place. Um, and we know that we um, carry Jesus with us in our hearts and he helps us to change the world. And sometimes at Kids Club we talk about people who have changed the world, who've done really amazing things with their lives to inspire us um, to see how we can um, make positive choices for our lives and um, we talk about how we believe you can do that wherever you are. So this week's story is going to be about Jackie Pullinger. Now Jackie was a really incredible lady. She went to places that nobody else went um, but it all started with a dream. So Jackie um, was sleeping one night and God spoke to her in a dream. Now he gave her a picture of a world map. I wonder if you've ever seen a map before kids um, but it's basically just a um, kind of a, a picture of lots of different countries in the world and it shows you where they all are um, and I bet lots of you will know loads of different countries. I wonder if you've ever heard of Hong Kong, you'll have to go see if you can find it on a map for us and see where see where it is. Um, but Jackie felt God saying to her in a dream that she um, needed to go to Hong Kong. So God said go but Jackie didn't know why but she was really really brave and she went. Now when Jackie got there, um, she went to the walled city. Um, so it was a city that had loads of um, walls built around it. But, but inside that walled city, things were um, a bit different to how things are here. Um, there was a lot of crime, there was a lot of violence, a lot of fighting, um, and things weren't so good there. But Jackie really felt like God was telling her to go and, and be there. Um, so she did, she, she went and she took God's strength with her and she knew that she was um, not alone and, and she went as a teacher so she went to teach in one of the schools there and she started teaching English classes um, and she also started um, teaching like music so um, with percussion you know, like instruments that you hit um, and that was kind of her way in really with the young people and um, so she um, taught music and, and English with those people the younger people um, and she really really felt like she wanted to do a bit more than just teaching because Jackie loved Jesus and Jesus was her friend and she really wanted to tell people about Jesus and um, so after she'd spent a bit of time there kind of getting to know um, the place and kind of she'd been living there a couple of months she decided she really wanted to um, to help these gang members so there were people in gangs kids who um, were doing things that weren't weren't very good um, with their lives they um, were involved in a lot of crime um, to breaking the law and they were um, getting in a lot of fights and they were hurting themselves and they were hurting other people um, but Jackie saw them and she wanted to love them she wanted to love the people that nobody else loved and she wanted to share Jesus with them the most important thing that she had um, so she did that by just by listening and by getting to know them and by um, just being really real with them and honest with them um, and I think some of these um, these men had never really experienced that before and they, they said to her that um, Jackie um, made them feel like they were understood she loved them for who they really were um, and she accepted them and um, she she understood their pains they were going through some things that made them feel sad and um, as we all have things that make us sad sometimes and and they didn't didn't necessarily have people they could talk to but Jackie um, was different and they realised that she was someone who um, they could trust and there's one um, really important member of the gang who was like the head, he's like the head teacher if you like, he was kind of the head of the whole gang and he realised that Jackie was, was different to a lot of people and at first they thought was she part of the police, was she going undercover, like why does she want to do all these things for the young people in the walled city because um, it was quite rare for someone from a different country to want to come and live there um, and let alone you know stay there for a long time because it was quite dangerous um, but when they realised Jackie was doing it to make their lives better this guy decided that he, he wanted to know Jesus too he said whatever Jackie has I, I want that because that is something something amazing and there's something different about her life that I don't have 
Um, so Jackie changed the world because she helped lots of members of gangs like this one man to realise that they were loved and to realise that they could do different things with their lives and they could make different choices. Um, and she had homes for people who could come when they were poorly um, and she helped them get better. And she was just really, really amazing and she, she loved people really well. And you know, she was so amazing that the Queen decided to give her a special award for all the things that she did with her life to say thank you. Um, it's called an MBE, so she recognised um, the amazing work that Jackie Pullinger did. Um, and she didn't get paid for any of that, you know, she, she lived off um, people donating things to her, so giving her money to, to help her to live and to keep going. But she did it because um, she felt like these people needed to know of Jesus' love. Um, and they weren't going to, to church or to um, youth groups or to, um, they didn't know people who knew Jesus, but um, Jackie wanted to tell them that he loved them and that he cared for them and that he had great plans for their lives. So we want you to know today, kids, that wherever you are, um, you can change the world too. Because we have Jesus in our hearts and he, um, he is with us wherever we go. And he helps us to love people um, and to be kind to people and to help them to understand and to see that they can make good, good choices with their lives and that they can do great things. So we look forward to seeing you next time for the next World Changes Tea Party. But in the meantime, why don't you go check out some of our other videos because um, we've got a few different ones on there. Um, and we'll see you soon, kids. Bye.